So My Little Cat is an educational awareness project based in Whitehaven in West Cumbria and it focuses on all different areas relating to sustainable seafood and marine wildlife. The project's been running two and a half years so it's involved a lot of different things and that's kind of evolved as we go. Um, but if I was to group it into a few main areas there's what I'd call seafood outreach which is kind of going to food festivals, farmers markets, working with fishermen, working with restaurants and doing lots of different activities to teach people about sustainable seafood, about sustainable fishing methods and about how they can make an improvement to the sustainability of their diets or to their supply chains if it's for businesses. Um, the second main area is educational activities. So we've been working with youth groups, with community groups, with secondary schools, with youth theatre and doing all kinds of different things, getting especially young people and also kind of vulnerable adults and other members of the community involved in the marine environment in learning about the wildlife that lives there and learning about seafood too but much more from an angle of kind of getting connected to our coast and the habitats. And the third thing is broader community events, things like Sea Fest, our festival of the sea that involves all kinds of different really fun activities like sand sculpture competition and crafts and cooking demos and live theatre and music. Um, but also smaller events that people can come along to, so things like rock pooling, snorkelling, foraging, all kinds of different events, getting people out onto the coast and appreciating the wonderful wildlife we have here in Cumbria. Lots of people tell us that interacting with My Local Catch, coming along to our events, gives them a completely new way to experience the coast. For example, on one of our snorkel safaris, we had someone telling us they'd never thought, like they'd never be brave enough to swim in the sea on our coastline, and this has given them the confidence to do that. Lots of people will come to our stores saying that they've tried seafood for the first time there and they'll now go away and try it for themselves. Lots of people, when we take them out to the rock pools, just say they had no idea they have this kind of wildlife on the Cumbrian coast. And that's really important from a conservation point of view because if people don't know what's there, they don't know how they need to protect it. So raising awareness about the wildlife that lives on our coast means that local people are much more empowered to talk to their MPs, to talk to the lawmakers about making sure we're protecting that wildlife but also from a well-being and a nature connection point of view, helping people to really see how magical the places they live are has fantastic impacts throughout the whole community. One of the targets of My Local Catch was to monitor the coastal marine habitats around the northwest, and we chose to do that through citizen science programmes that got people in the communities involved with actually looking and seeing what was on the shorelines. Through that, we've actually built on that and have developed a programme called Marine Champions, whereby we can train people, anyone who is interested, to actually go out and lead citizen science surveys themselves, and as well as that meaning that we can do a lot more of that surveying, it's also upskilled the community around the northwest to take more action for their coasts. We had a really wide range of people involved in the Marine Champions programme, so I think we had university students, we had retirees, um, I think our youngest participant was 14 who came along with their dad, but it was really genuinely the call went out to anyone who had an interest in that marine environment who wanted to play a bigger part and learn more and take more action. The Marine Champions have been wonderful. It's been so encouraging and just so fun to go out with a group of people who um, are already enthusiastic about the marine environment, but actually be able to be a part of giving people more skills and more knowledge. Um, we've done a lot of surveys with that group. A lot of the people who started as Marine Champions actually started by coming along to one of our surveys as a participant. And over the six-month training programme, um, started learning bits of that process, started trialling bits um, that we kept giving over to them and saying, right, you give the briefing this time. And over the course of that time, uh, have now got to a point where they can lead those surveys fully themselves. I'm a marine champion, so I've undergone six months of training to be able to lead my own sea watches and rocky shore surveys with a group of people, which is super exciting. I was a shy 16-year-old girl with very little confidence when I started, and volunteering with the trust has just it's just brought my, again, brought my whole spirit up and just boosted my confidence. It's the best thing I've ever done. I'm hoping to do a marine biology degree. So all the skills I've learned from becoming a marine champion are going to be so valuable. The people skills, you know, get, putting myself out there, joining societies and clubs, it's just such an invaluable experience. 